started at Laney College in 2018 when I was in the eighth grade at Ile Hombre. I was 13. An experiment that had no study involvement and we just did it. But I had to work closely with the math department. I knew Laney College had this exceptional math program that had taken the traditional math curriculum and converted it into a program that was self-paced. And I thought that there's a prospect that our, our kids could actually do this. So as an eighth grader, I felt like a little kid just around a bunch of adults coming and looking around and seeing all these college students. It, I felt out of place, but I also felt like I deserved to be here. And getting my own college ID I felt like a little major step. You know, pull up to a college with three other eighth graders and uh, people asking, oh, what are you here for? Oh, I'm taking a test for this class. And then you find out that you're in the same class as like a 20 year old. So I thought it was pretty cool. So it was, it was, it was not easy to do. So the first time, uh, walked to admissions, the ideal of having an eighth grader, they're like, you can't have an eighth grader. We don't have any capacity to serve you by an eighth grade. You gotta leave you in high school, a junior. And I'm like, well, you mean there's no precedent for a student in middle school taking a class here? I feel like I'm representing my family, my school, you know, every day, and black people in general. So for her to be here in eighth grade is mine. I brag about it all the time. I see all my homeboys like, man, you know my daughter is at my junior college taking the math. I never took. So it's, I, I'm, I'm just happy for it, man. So they gave me a sense of uh, maturity that this is the level that I'm at and this is the level I need to stay at moving forward into high school. Math is, in many cases, seen by a lot of people as being one of the more difficult subjects. Um, in a student's young career, that here at the school, anybody who's enrolled um, at Lane in eighth grade is required uh, once every quarter to teach an algebra class. And so what that requires them to do is they have to create the entire lesson themselves. Um, I'll pluck out a lesson, uh, you know, once every quarter, it might be on linear systems, or it might be on, uh, on graphing, it might be on uh, solving radicals. I took algebra two, which was, Weirdly a breeze for me too, since I had never learned it. But I already had a strong foundation at Illumina. Now I'm taking, I took pre calc my sophomore year, I believe, and calculus my junior year, and now I'm taking multi variable calculus. Put us an example of how well that they have been able to do uh, having that start from Lady College, and also getting a sense of that, you know, I not only can I go to college, and not only will I go to college, but I am going to college. It's a whole different mindset, I think. I went to Howard for four years and I was accepted into the School of Business Executive Leadership Program. Um, upon my freshman year, like arrival, I was like automatically accepted based on my like, grade, GPA, just like I guess overall resume. Uh, going into high school and taking um, our another two trades all the way up to AP Calculus, um, seeing that I was the only black person, it kind of made me think back to my time being at Illinois and then they're preparing me for um, high school rigor and even uh, college. It's exciting to me because I can tell people that like, I'm that good at math or I'm that good at school to do something like that. What I plan on doing my first camp, being able to take classes here at Laney, I feel like I'll just use that to do better in high school. Although oh, high school is like really important to get into like the universities or colleges that, you wanna go, that I wanna go to, um, it's like middle school is like the beginning of all that. So at Laney College, you better get ready for my kids because they're coming.